Hi, it's Tom here from Tom's Deck Reviews, and in this short video guide, I'm going to show you how to connect your Jinhu projector to your iPhone. So, without further ado, let's get going. Before we can connect our Jinhu projector to our iPhone, we need to connect it to our home Wi Fi network, and I'll show you how to do that now. If your Jinhu projector is already connected to your home Wi Fi, then feel free to skip to stage two in this guide where I'll show you how to connect it to your iPhone. As soon as you switch on your Jinhu projector, you're presented with this setup screen. So the first thing we need to do is choose setup. I'm using the remote control to navigate the screen, but you can also use the control buttons on the top of your Jinhu projector. Now let's click on setup using the OK button on the remote. And we are presented with a setup network screen where we can set up our home Wi-Fi connection. Using the down arrow on our remote, let's select Wi-Fi. Now let's click on it and it should bring up the scan option. Let's click on scan and we should get a pop-up message saying Wi-Fi app searching. After a short while, it should bring up our Wi-Fi connection. Mine is second in the list. So let's click on that. And now we need to enter our password. And if you don't have your password to hand, it should be displayed at the back of your internet router. After entering our password, let's click on confirm. And we should get the pop-up message, Wi-Fi connecting. And after a few seconds, success. Now let's click on confirm. And then I got the pop-up message, Wi-Fi app searching again. And I thought, are we just going around in a loop? But no need to worry, as after a few seconds, this pop-up message disappears. And you should now get a green tick next to your Wi-Fi ID, confirming that your Wi-Fi network is connected. And all we need to do now is click on return on the remote to get us back to the original setup screen. After connecting our Jinhu projector to our home Wi-Fi network, we can now connect it to our iPhone. Please bear in mind though that they both need to be connected to the same home Wi-Fi network for it to work. So starting from the setup screen, we need to tap across and select iOS Cast. If we wanted to connect an Android phone, then we would click on the Miracast button. But as I want to connect my iPhone to our Mini, I'm going to click on iOS Cast. And then we get instructions on how to connect our iPhone. And if we now go to our iPhone and get the control panel up, and depending on the version of your iPhone, you can display the control panel by either swiping up from the bottom of your iPhone screen, or in the case of the iPhone 12, which I'm using, you'll need to swipe down from the top right of your screen. And now we can see a tab for screen mirroring. Let's tap on screen mirroring, and then tap on the device listed called ZYCast. And after a few seconds, our iPhone is connected. I'll now use my Face ID to unlock my iPhone screen and show you how well it streams media to the Jinhu projector. And as you can see, whatever appears on my iPhone screen is mirrored onto the projector screen. And that's all there is to it. If you like this video, please thumbs it up and subscribe for more tech guides and reviews to come. Thanks for watching.